down, 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 up, 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 up. Welcome guys, well, welcome guys, how you guys doing? Welcome to the next episode of our Pokemon Christmas. I think this is either the fifth, I think it's the fifth, right? Last one was the fourth, so this is the fifth episode for Pokemon Christmas and Nuzlocke. How you guys doing? Welcome to the episode. Hope you guys are having a fantastic day. Um, so we found a full heal actually, pretty darn interesting. Uh, but yeah, we went through the uh, the cave in the last episode, did some things, and we need to figure out the thing with Team Rocket. What? Uh, there's no cave opening behind me. You must be seeing things, kid. Uh, definitely not seeing things. Uh, I never knew there was an icy cave behind a slowpoke well. I knew I saw Delibird at times, but never knew how they got there. Uh, now it all makes sense. Okay, so I think. I know there's something that we need to do before. We can't get into the gym just yet, so I know we need to do something. You know about Delibird? Make loads of gifts that so they should be free to take. Hmm. Um, let's see. So we have the uh, Charcoal Clin or Kiln. Something like that. Did we get anything from you? I don't remember. Um, but yeah. So, just got home from work. Probably going to take a shower after this episode and then get this episode edited and uploaded for you guys to enjoy. Also, if you guys are enjoying the content, make sure to definitely like. Uh, like every episode cuz every episode if we can get five likes per episode that's pretty darn awesome I believe we have to talk to you, right? Something about that Yeah, I know about team rocket So I believe he goes ahead and goes take care of team rocket if I do remember uh, See yep, there we go. Hurts on the way Alrighty, so we have to go ahead and talk to you uh, We already talked to the daughter, so there's not a whole lot going on um, but yeah, definitely this is going to be probably, hopefully if we can get our next gym badge, that's going to be a, an event, the eventful episode, so pretty darn awesome there. Um, but yeah, so what did you guys do today? What did you guys do? Um, let's see, obviously I had work, that is no doubt, um, but yeah, pretty darn cool stuff. Um, I also do have Saturday and Mondays off. So that is pretty good to know. So I can definitely make sure that I'm able to do videos on those days as well. So that's pretty cool. Uh, two two free days off of work, which is all right. <clears throat> um, let's see what else. I'm let's see. Let's check our. I don't know if we need anything at the moment. But we're gonna go ahead and check just in the case. Uh, let's see. So we have five pokeballs and two great balls. So we can go ahead and get our next encounter in the in the ice cave or whatever it's called, something like that. So we'll make sure to go ahead and go inside here. Enough of dilly dallying. <clears throat> hey there, NPC. Uh, the guards off of there took off when I shouted at them. Well, my Pokemon are old like me. Uh, they're not strong enough to take on Team Rocket these days. Uh, I know you can teach them a thing or two in my place. I need you to save those deli bird. Save Christmas. That is definitely our job. So what is our encounter for this cave? It is going to be a Zubat. It's not not terrible. Uh, not terrible, but we can definitely go ahead and catch this. Um, I'm probably going to see if I can just paralyze it and then catch it. So if we can do that, that would be pretty darn awesome. Okay. <clears throat> um, but yeah. Uh, so we got Zubat, Crobat, and then, um, let's see, or Gold, Zubat, Golbat, and Crobat. Uh, yeah, Crobat's alright, but if I remember with Crobat, I don't remember if it was changed in this ROM hack, but you have to trade, uh, Goldbat in order to actually get it to be a, um, a, um, uh, Crobat. Let's go ahead and toss our Great Ball, we'll see if we can catch this thing. And we did not catch it, which is fine. Uh, so we're gonna go ahead and throw our Pokeballs. See if we can use that. There we go. G G G. G G G. Pretty cool stuff. Um, Zubat. Also, again, if you guys want to be nicknamed after any Pokemon that I do catch, make sure to leave a comment down below, and make sure to let me know what name you would want, or if you want your name to be used. You know, just let me know, and I can go ahead and add that and make sure I do that. Let's see. For this Zubat. 
Um, let's see. What do I want to name the zoo guy? It's a female. Um, let's name let's name this. Um, let's see. I'll name it. Let's name it Rose. I don't know why. We'll just name it Rose. R O S E. So definitely name it Rose. Cause why not? Why the heck not? Okay, so we have a um, a zoo bat in the PC. Pretty cool stuff there. Uh, but we are going to go ahead and make sure to take on Team Rocket. And hopefully, if we if we have enough time in today's episode, which hopefully we should, because we're at five minutes um, at the moment of recording this episode. Again, it is 5:58 my time, so almost 6 p.m. Um, but yeah, definitely, definitely, I am hoping to. Uh, make sure I get this episode uploaded in a timely manner and uh, make sure that we are consistent with these episodes because again I want to make sure I finish this series before the end of December which is definitely the plan uh, um, to do. I at least want to make sure we beat the Elite Four um, and then if we can beat the Elite Four before the end of Christmas if, we, if there is Kanto, I don't remember if there is, but if there is um, I'd assume there is, because gold and silver both have Kanto, I believe. Um, but if not, then that's fine. So we have Deli Birds here, pretty cool stuff. Go ahead and take on the next Team Rocket here. <clears throat> uh, but yeah, we didn't have a whole lot of um, whole lot of stuff to do at work. Um, but we did try and do stuff that we could do. Nose is a little itchy, which I'm not quite sure exactly why, but you know, things happen. Things happened, and it be like that sometimes, you know, because just because thing things happen, and you know. Uh, and Ekans is coming out. Also, I'm pretty sure everyone knows this by now, but if you spell Ekans backwards, it's basically snake. Not quite sure why um, the Pokemon Company did that. I'm pretty sure they were just being lazy with Ekans' name, and they were like, you know what, we're gonna add a snake Pokemon, we're just gonna spell it backwards to give it a, uh, a flare. I don't know. I don't know. If you know the exact reasoning, you can definitely leave a comment down below letting me know why that reasoning, reasoning is. Uh, let's see, Quick Attack. We are learning Quick Attack. Let's get rid of Leer. So definitely don't need Leer, and don't really need, um... That other move, which is whatever it is, I don't really, don't really know. But anyways, I'm gonna go ahead and continue on. Uh, we already have a Zubat, so let's go ahead and run from that battle. Go ahead and make sure we do that. Don't know if there's anything else down the ladder. I don't remember, but I believe we just need to take on this last person because I don't think we can get to that ladder. So I think we need like Rock Smash, Rock Smash, and or Strength. Okay. So easy peasy. Plus, if I remember correctly, uh, the next gym is a grass type, so we should be able to breeze on by fairly easily. I think we have a rival battle before the forest. I don't remember. I assume we have a um, a rival battle. <clears throat> yeah, we had a previous rival battle before the uh, the end of the last episode. So pretty crazy stuff. It was actually a pretty easy battle. Pretty much of a pushover, to be honest. Um, so one more Zubat should be fairly easy enough because obviously Team Team um, Team Rocket doesn't really know how to level their Pokemon properly, so we are basically just kind of OP at the moment until they actually get better. I don't remember when they get better. I don't think they actually get any better to be honest, because we're always a much higher level than they are. Let's go ahead and battle you real quick. We can grab that item down there, hopefully. Okay, yeah, we're definitely gonna need to make sure. Yeah, this is the admin. You have a meowth. Also, interesting thing with um, Sword and Shield, there is a Galarian meowth, and the evolution really isn't um, Persian. It's like Berserker, which is interesting. It's basically a, a pirate version meowth, I guess you can say. I don't have a switch just yet, but I'm hoping to get a switch at some point, and then I want to make sure I get. Um, either sword and or shield and make sure I have a uh, capture card so I can go ahead and do that stuff um, but yeah definitely at some point I do want to do either um, 
Uh, so then eventually when I do get a switch in Pokemon Sword and or Shield, what do you guys prefer? Do you want recorded episodes or do you want uh, the episodes to be streamed? Let me know in the comments below. It'd be fairly cool to uh, to know. I know a lot of people are streaming Sword and Shield. Some people are doing recorded episodes as well. Um, and I know recorded episodes are fairly good. Oh, I forgot that we go back. Um, okay, so what I want to quickly do is let's go ahead and quickly get back over there. I don't remember if we actually go down this well. Do we not go down the well? I guess we don't go down the well. Oh, we have a snubble in here now. That would have actually been nice to have. Okay, let's go ahead and grab this item if we can actually do that. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and grab this item. Super Potion. I don't want to see quickly uh, if there is anything specifically down here. So I don't remember if there was anything. Okay, who are you? Uh, muddy Slope is too... So let's see, a bicycle might be fast enough to get up it though. Oh... I believe, let's see, we don't have a bike yet, if I remember correctly. Yeah, we don't have a bike or anything. So I guess there's really nothing we can do until we actually get a bike, so we'll have to come back. Definitely have to come back for that. I don't remember if there was anything um, up there. But anyways, when we do get our bike, we'll make sure to come back. I don't think uh, going down the ladder um, enters another area for encounters. So we are perfectly fine there. So let's make sure that we heal up. Then we should be able to take on the gym. We are at 11 minutes, so definitely we have plenty of time. Okay. Go ahead and go into lay gym. See what we got going on. Should be fairly easy. Because we do have our quill lava, so definitely it should be an easy fight to be honest. Okay, let's see what you guys got. A late bar, pretty dang easy. Level 10, not too worried in the slightest because we have Ember. It'll be an easy peasy. Bop boop beep. See you later. I'm gonna try and do minimal speed up here just so we can get past this gym. Because obviously, gym fights are, are fine and all, but you know, just want to make sure that we're not taking up too much time. Because um, obviously, animation. Okay. Go ahead and take on you. If we can get past this next uh, trainer, then we can go ahead and straight on to the, uh, the gym leader. So we can go ahead and battle gym leader there. Alrighty. <clears throat> Pretty cool stuff there. Butterfree. Not too worried in at the slightest because we are faster. Pop boop beep goes the Butterfree, we're level 22, fairly good stuff there, and there is a Beedrill coming out, so we shouldn't be worried in the slightest either, that is level 12, pop boop beep, it is down, easy, easy, gg, no re, <laughs> whatever you want to call it, okay, can we get past this trainer, I don't know if we'll be able to get past this trainer, but oh well. I wasn't sure if we'd be able to get past it anyways, to be honest, but we'll just go ahead and make sure that we battle you, which shouldn't be too simple, or shouldn't be too hard. Okay, so we'll go for Ember, take out this Weedle, easy peasy. Okay, you got Kakuna, not too worried in the slightest. Go ahead and bop boop beep, see ya later. Okay, what do you have last? You have a Beedrill, which I'm probably not worried in the slightest either. It's only level 12, and again, we are faster than it, and we are obviously, what, 12 times if effective, something like that. Level 23, yeah, definitely we'll make sure to level up our team, um, because obviously Quill Lava is getting a little bit higher in level. I am Bugsy, uh, comes to the Pokemon, let's see. My research is going to make me the authority on a bug Pokemon. Let me demonstrate what I've learned from my studies. Sure, Bugsy, sure. If I remember correctly, Bugsy is a guy. So, pretty interesting stuff. <clears throat> we have a Butterfree at level 15. Definitely not worried in the slightest. You lived on one. And you go for String Shot. Huh. Interesting. <laughs> I don't know why you go for string shot, but okay. Anyways, we are at 14 minutes so far. 
<clears throat> got a Beedrill coming out. I don't remember if you originally had three Pokemon or if you had two Pokemon. Uh, we are going to go ahead and go with the Ember. Wow, I'm actually surprised. Your Pokemon are living on one HP. That's actually crazy. To be honest, that is really crazy. Hoping we could just breeze by this last Pokemon, to be honest here. And we have the Scyther. Scyther! Level 17. Good stuff there. You are probably, yeah, I, I figured you were going to live. Fury Cutter, no problemo. Not worried in the slightest. Okay. Also, if you guys want to join the Discord again, link is in the description below. There's a social link that has the Discord, Twitter, and Instagram. If you guys want to follow the follow me on Twitter and Instagram, all that good stuff. I do try and post on a Twitter and Instagram a lot. Uh, I've been posting out the episodes on Instagram, so definitely you guys can see that. And we do have the Hive Badge. That's pretty darn awesome. With the benefits of the Hive Badge, uh, we can use Cut Outside of Battle. And we get TM49, which is probably Fury... Fury Cutter, whatever, something. Yeah, Fury Cutter. Easy. Cool. Um, so I believe we have Cut. If I remember correctly. Oh no, we don't have Cut just yet. We get Cut from the, uh, the dude in the forest. That's right. We have to go to the forest, wrap up the, um, what is it, the sparrows or deli birds or something. Let's make sure we heal up because I believe, I believe we're gonna have a, another rival battle to be honest, so we always want to make sure that we are ready for anything. Yep, we have our rival battle. Hi guys, do an NPC, it is true. Uh, has, um, has Team Rocket really returned? Wow, you beat them. That's amazing. Uh, it won't be much of a match compared to them. But could we battle? Sure, why not? Hopefully, hopefully you aren't too much. Yeah, you have a Zigzagoon, level 12. Just gonna go for the Ember. Bop boop beep, you are dead. And then you have the Meryl, right? Oh, well, you have Meryl and you have one other Pokemon. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and go out to our Pikachu here. Meryl is level 16, we are level 17. So we should have no problem whatsoever. Gonna go with that T-Shock. Gonna be super effective, but it doesn't one hit. Which is all, all good, all good, no worries. You have rollout, and you missed, which is good. Definitely that is good. Okay, so Bapu Beep goes the Meryl. And then your last Pokemon is the Vulpix. Um, we don't have a fire type. Um, I think we'll stay out with our Pikachu for now. We'll just go with the T-Shock, go with the Ember, that's fine. We'll just go with the T-Shock, go with that Ember. Okay. Make sure we'll probably swap out. Actually, oh, never mind, we got the burn. Yeah, okay. Uh, to play it safe, we're just going to go ahead and swap out into our Pidgey here. Ember. God dang, that burn, that's really annoying. That is really annoying, to be honest. I don't like that burn. Super annoying. We did make sure that we got that taken care of. Okay, cool, Leo. Uh, even though I lost, I still love to battle. Uh, it helps you to learn what you can improve, you know? Maybe next time I'll be a better match for you. In the meantime, never stop your training. I'm gonna keep at it too. Maybe one day I'll even, uh, I'll, e I'll be even stronger than you are. Uh, see you later, NPC. Best of luck. What's interesting is that our rival is actually a little bit better um, than uh, whatchamacallit because you have the male and the female protagonist and basically our rival is the female protagonist which is pretty interesting that they would do that instead of um, whatever the original whatever the original rival normally is I don't remember the exact name um, but yeah definitely he's like uh, I don't really care uh, I lost. Whatever. What gives? <laughs> I don't know. We now are in the, the snowy cave. Let's go ahead and see if we can go ahead and get through this pretty easily. We are at 19 minutes, so definitely we will make sure to wrap this video up at a decent time so I can go ahead and make sure I edit, make sure I get the sync in and everything. Okay. And then hopefully get the thumbnail ready as well, because that will be good. 
to do. Uh, I'll probably find a um, probably find somewhere to get a screenshot and make sure that we do that for the thumbnail. Uh, but yeah, we do have the the deli birds. Yep, need to make sure we take care of the deli birds. Oh, never mind. We got HMO1 right off the bat. Do we not need to do the um? Do we not need to do the deli bird thing? Let's go ahead and check just to make sure. Um, so I guess we don't need to, yeah, because then we have just trainers, that's right. So basically we can, we can basically skip this. Uh, we'll probably come back. Um, let's see, oh, I think I may have, oh well, which is fine. There, there wasn't many Pokemon in here in the first place anyways. So basically we can go ahead and teach HMO1 Cut to our... Uh, quilt lava. Go ahead and do that. Yeah, let's go ahead and do. Actually, let's put it on our Zigzagoon, I believe, as tails. <clears throat> um, yeah, let's get rid of. Let's actually get rid of Sand Attack, to be honest. Okay. Got rid of Cut for uh, Sand Attack. Go ahead and get through here. Yeah, there is a really old E event. With this thing, I don't remember if it was in the old games, but Heart Gold and Soul Silver. Um, actually, I think it does work because you need the GS ball, and you can get Celebi. Alex uh, for a shrine, or the forest protector. Um, but yeah, I don't remember if that event actually works. I don't remember if it works in this ROM hack. Um, but yeah, if you have the GS ball and you come back, then you can get Celebi. And then in Heart Gold and Soul Silver. If you, um, uh, let's see, oh, heart scale. Wait, hold on. Do do do, uh, move tutor. Oh, you teach mega horn. Interesting. Okay. Uh, so let's go ahead and see if we can quickly get out of here. We have another trainer coming up. So if we can quickly go ahead and get out of here. And we can definitely go ahead and wrap up this episode. We have a few more trainers, to be honest. Uh, but what I'll do is I'll go ahead and save here. We can pick up tomorrow, finish off these trainers, get to the next town, all that jazz. Uh, but yeah, if you guys did enjoy today's episode, make sure to smash that like button. Subscribe if you guys are new to the channel, as I am going to make sure that we are consistent with every episode. And uh, get these up in a timely manner and all that good good. Uh, good stuff um anything if you guys want to post a comment down there in the, in the description or not description comment section comment section if you guys want to post a comment down there make sure to do that and i'll go ahead and read it and answer anything that you guys ask or whatever so again if you guys enjoy do all that good stuff i'll see all of you guys in the next episode peace have a good